in this video we will see how to estimate the pairwise correlation matrix using stata for instance we want to estimate the correlations between the variables so we put here pw c o r r so we click with this command we can find this table of pairwise correlations but but there is a problem with this command that it gives you the correlation matrix of all the variables given in the data sheet we want to estimate the correlation matrix only for selected variables so for this we write here pw c o r r space the names of variables that you want to find or estimate the correlation matrix of for example i have co2 i have gdp r i can also write here renewable energy just the re urb and similarly fidi so i click here we have used this command to estimate the correlation matrix between these selected variables so this is the resultant vari um, table that is showing us the correlations between the variables similarly if we want to estimate the correlation matrix but we also want to test the significance of these variables so we will add an additional command that is comma sig so in this case you can see it will also give you the p values which will help us to find out uh, whether these correlations are significant or not we can also add some other command just like star at 0.05 so the addition of this star command will help us to obtain a table which will show us uh, if the correlation coefficient is significant at 5% level it will put the star on these values for, uh, such as the correlation between gdpr and co2 is positive and it is significant at 5% level so it will give you the star similarly if you also want want to uh, add the number of observations in the table so you add obs command here we can see that in this table the stata gives you the number of observations of each variable so this command will give you the correlation value the p value and the total number of observations used for the correlation estimations we can interpret this correlation coefficients correlation coefficient between gdpr and co2 is 0.15 so it means the correlation between the co2 and gdp in our data is uh, weakly correlated but it is significant at 5% level and total number of observation used in these estimations are 375 similarly the correlation coefficient between re variable and co2 is also positive and it is also significant at 5% level as the p value is less than 5% the correlation coefficient between urb and co2 is negative but it is significant at 5% level you can see the p value is less than 5% and the correlation coefficient between fidi and co2 is positive it shows that the correlation between fidi and co2 is weak but positive and it is also significant at 5% level